recent trip down the Green River in Utah, we were confronted with water that was extremely silt ridden. It was so bad that conventional treatment methods for drinking and cooking with it would never work. Our filters would just clog instantly, and boiling would just produce hot mud. Carrying all our water with us in huge jugs seemed like our only alternative. We knew about this well in advance of our trip, so we had an opportunity to discuss our dilemma with our friend Cliff. He explained to us the method he uses for camping along silty rivers like the Green. We experimented with this and put together the short tutorial. First, we scooped up some river water in a bucket. This is what clarifies the water. We found ours on the shelf of our local drugstore. Be prepared though, the teenager you ask for help will have no idea what alum is or where it is on their shelf. Drop about a half a teaspoon into a gallon or so of water. Stir it in with the dirty stick you found on the ground, going in only one direction. Why the same direction? I have no idea. I'm just doing what I was told. Stir it for about a minute, then let it sit. Right away you'll start seeing the silt collecting into larger clumps and sinking to the bottom. After 20 or 30 minutes, you'll notice the water is becoming much, much clearer. After about an hour or two, you can begin carefully scooping clear water off the top, being very careful not to disturb the silt collected on the bottom. Now this just takes the silt out. You'll still need to run it through your favorite treatment process. I'm interested in finding out if this works on tannin choked water like we find in the northern lakes. If you try it, please let us know how it turns out. See you on the next river.